subject and predicate in this grammar topic today we are going to do subject and predicate we all know that a sentence is a group of words right so a sentence always contains a subject and predicate now what is subject the subject is the person or thing that is doing the action the subject is the who or what the sentence is about so the whole sentence focus on the subject right the predicate the predicate tells what the subject does it contains action the part of sentence that contains action that tells us about what the subject does is predicate now let's do subject first the farmer works in the field now the question is who works in the field the answer is clear the farmer so the person who the person who does the action is the subject the farmer the farmer in the sentence is subject now how to select subject there is one ground rule whenever you have to find subject in the sentence first i find out the verb right find the verb then make a question by placing who or what before it for example in the first sentence the farmer works in the field now the verb is works right now ask the question who works in the field so the answer is the farmer the farmer the farmer works in the field right let's try some more the dog broke the chain and ran away now what is the verb in this sentence the dog broke the chain and ran away the word broke is verb here right now find the subject ask yourself question who broke the chain the dog the dog broke the chain and ran away so the dog is subject in this sentence there are some more examples the lion is the king of the jungle who is the king of the jungle the lion right pinky and her dog run in the garden every evening now what is the verb here run what is the verb run now who run in the garden every evening pinky and her dog so pinky and her dog is the subject in the sentence now it's your turn to pick the subject right so my sister tripped over the stone the teacher explained the lesson in detail my kitten loves to play with me the big green box was laying in front of my house in these sentences you have to find out subject first look for the verb look for the action and after the action ask yourself who or what right then you will uh, find out the subject now predicate predicate always a verb that links up with the subject so predicate is a verb is a action and it tells us about what the subject is doing okay it refers to the action of the subject the boy painted the wall carefully now who painted the wall carefully the boy the boy is subject here now what the boy did boy what boy did what was their action so the boy painted the wall carefully so painted the verb painted is the verb in the sentence so painted the wall carefully is predicate So the boy painted the wall carefully. Choose the predicate. Always look for the verb. The verb is painted here. Painted the action. Ask question. What is the action of the subject? We know the boy. The boy is the subject. So what is the subject doing? Painted the wall carefully. Right. So the predicate is the part of the sentence that contains the verb. and tell us something about the subject right it gives us information about the subject now 
Peggy Kids. I visit grandmother on Thursdays. Now first you have to find out the verb. Verb is visit here. Visit. So what I do? What I do every on Thursdays? That I visit. Right. Where I visit? Grandmother. I visit. So what is the predicate? Visit. Grandmother on Thursdays is Peggy. Bunty and Billu went to the fair. Right? Bunty and Billu. What Bunty and Billu? We are, what we are talking about Bunty and Billu? We are talking that Bunty and Billu went to the fair. So their action is went, went to the fair. It's predicate. Now in third sentence we are giving some information about the elephants. The elephants were crossing the river to join their herd. What were elephants doing? What was their action? Right? So the elephants were crossing the river to join their herd. So this is predicate. The garden was full of beautiful flowers. Yes. In this sentence we are talking about garden. We are giving some information about garden. We are saying that garden was full of beautiful flowers. So what is the verb here? Was. Was full of beautiful flowers. Predicate. The words that are underlined words are underlined something refers to predicate. Right. So this is practice work for you. Choose the predicate from the following sentences. The Mount Everest is the highest peak of the mountain. The rainbow has seven colors. The king gave his kingdom to his brother. I presented a bouquet to my friend on the birthday. So these four sentences in these four sentences you will find out predicate and do the exercise. Right. So. This is the end of this video. Now solve the quiz and check your understanding of the topic. Uh, I am going to send you one quiz also that I will send you link. Go on that link, solve the quiz and you will come to about your understanding of this topic. So have a happy learning. Stay blessed. Bye bye.